Hi everyone, this is Dave Zakos, broker and owner of Zakos Realty and Design. Today I wanted to give you an overview of a top pick of a neighborhood in Inglewood, Florida. Um, as Sarasota and Venice become more and more crowded, people are moving to this area from all across the country and internationally. Good options, I think, are to look south in the county. In this video, I'm going to give you an overview of, of a neighborhood called Overbrook Gardens. Overbrook Gardens is located in Inglewood, located in the northernmost portion of Inglewood. Highway 41 is the main thoroughfare throughout Sarasota County, uh, also known as Tamiami Trail. Uh, it starts in Sarasota, runs through the city of Sarasota, then through Osprey, Nokomis, Venice, and then it cuts to the southeast and runs through Welland Park and Northport before moving on to Charlotte County and south towards Fort Myers. Well, what most people don't realize is that um, south of Venice is a what I call still a little sleepy little town of Inglewood. Uh, it doesn't get all the traffic that uh, Venice and Sarasota gets because most of the growth is along that 41 and that I-75 corridor. So Venice, as it runs to the southeast, people follow that south 41, they go to Welland Park, they go on to Northport, and they don't realize Inglewood's right there. Inglewood misses much of the traffic, um, but yet you're not far from the beaches. As a matter of fact, Overbrook Garden I'm going to talk about, actually most of the community is less than two miles to the beach. Uh, when I was a community policing deputy back in the 90s, I patrolled the area, I worked in the local schools, taught the Pal kids on the athletic fields, and Overbrook Garden was always a top pick community that I just kind of fell in love with. It's so close to Minnesota Beach. Many of the homes are built in the 60s, so they're a little bit older. Uh, you may find one that needs a little bit of work, but Minnesota Beach and the boat ramp are just a short two minute drive away. You could actually take your bicycle or you can walk because you can follow the back streets. You don't have to go on any main highways. You take Overbrook Boulevard, you cut over to Bayshore Drive, and then Alamander, and this takes you out to Minnesota Beach Road, just over the bridge and you're on the beach. So Overbrook Garden consists of about 530 homes, about 100 of them, or just over 100 of them are actual waterfront homes located on Fork Creek. This is a uh, waterway that leads directly out to Lemon Bay, very boatable, navigable water. The pros of this neighborhood is that it's in Sarasota County, so you have excellent county services. Your roads, your trash, your recycling, your police services are all provided by Sarasota County. The other pro on it is very affordable. Uh, when you compare it to the other homes in the area within a mile or two mile, you can find homes still in the mid twos to the mid threes. Another pro of it is there's no HOA, so for this reason, um, you don't have burdensome fees, but there is a voluntary HOA of $75 a year, which gives you access to the boat ramp. Think of this, you're in your house, uh, you want to take your boat, put it out on the water, uh, you don't have waterfront property, you can't afford this, this is a great community for you. Um, you leave your driveway and you go down the street around the corner, uh, you back into the boat ramp right there in the community and you're on the water in five minutes. You don't have to fight the crowds of the public boat ramp, all the traffic backing in, backing out. Um, just pull your truck, your car over and take off for the day. Um, the other great thing about it is it's just a few minutes down the historic Inglewood, the West Dearborn Street. There's Lemon Bay and there's several parks in Lemon Bay and, and nature preserves. Um, you can be to, in addition to Minnesota Beach, you can be on Middle Beach or Inglewood Beach all within about 10 minutes. Uh, the surrounding area is growing like crazy. Home prices are soaring. Uh, this little community is located close to Bayfront properties in the millions and five and six hundred thousand dollar homes and other price range within a couple miles. So this all makes it a, a very positive. Another pro on this is that since the community was built mostly in the 60s, the lots are a lot larger. So you've got room to add a pool if you don't have one. You've got room to keep your boat on site. Maybe you want to put a, a workshop or a shed on your property. Uh, most of these lots are plenty good size for that. If I was going to say any cons, I would say because of the 60s, these homes are built smaller traditionally. Many of them are two bedrooms, two baths, and they don't have a lot of extra space. Um, some of the community is in the AE flood zone, so you may be required flood insurance. I sold a home in this area before in the AE, and the flood insurance was very reasonable, about $600 for the year. Well, that's it for now. If you have any questions about any homes in Overbrook Gardens or any of the surrounding communities or uh, want details about the restrictions or anything else about the community, please feel free to reach out. I appreciate your time. Thanks for watching. and I look forward to speaking with you again soon. Bye.